The Bible says, And the Lord said unto Satan, Hast thou considered my servant Job, that there is none like him in the earth, a perfect and an upright man, one that feareth God and escheweth evil, and still he holdeth fast his integrity, although thou movest me against him to destroy him without cause? Someone said the test of a man's character is what he does in the dark. But truly the test of a person's character is what he does when difficulty is laid upon him. When he can't see what's going on perhaps, but knows he's going through a trial. If that is the darkness that a man must endure, then the test of a man's character is when he goes through that dark valley. It brings out who you really are. It exposes your lack or existence of true faith in the God you profess to believe in. And the Lord has allowed Job to feel some of Satan's touch. He's allowed the enemy to take Job's goods, to even take Job's family. And now God can point to Satan and say, still, He holdeth fast his integrity. Which brings up the question for us to consider, if God would allow the devil, the enemy, to lay some difficulty upon us, to allow us to venture and journey through a dark valley of our own, would we still hold fast our integrity? Would we still remain incorrupted? We still remain pure. Would our profession still be without blemish? Or would we curse God like Job's wife encouraged him to do? What a challenge. What an example. What a thought to consider. Because in the New Testament, we're told time and again, hold that fast which thou hast. We're we're told to hold fast the form of sound words. When God puts the weight on you, when God puts the darkness on you, will you pass the test or will you fail in the day and faint in the day of adversity? Will you hold fast your integrity or will you give up on God?